to the 12 as they roll into the backstretch. Bullet drills for Friday at Santa Anita, the fourth race. And I don't know if feeling graceful is faster than a speeding bullet, but she's fast. I can tell you that. And we learned that from a gate work she had in late March here for Bill Spar. Now, this is the filly on the inside. She's the gray daughter of Grayson. And uh, she's not really being asked much at all. Light coaxing only, working in company with Sweet Tea, who is an unstarted uh, into mischief filly. And I really like this work because it doesn't look like she's being asked much at all. She's kind of just galloping down the backstretch, maybe a short head behind her workmate. But as they go farther in this work, I, I think Feeling Graceful actually gets stronger. She's going to go 47-1 from the gate, 35-1 and of the 3 eighths. That means her final furlong was 12 flat, and that's what you'd like to see in a cowbred filly making her debut. So I think she's got plenty of speed, but she's not one of these fillies that kind of opens up and kind of gets tired. She's strong throughout and actually ahead in front here as they finish uh, to the quarter pole, which is the end of this half mile work. Now turning into the stretch, I, I really like the way Feeling Graceful has changed her leads on time. She's strong. She's just kind of cruising. And I think this is a decent sort of filly. But again, six to five on the morning line in the fourth race on Friday. Uh, she's a kind of an open secret. Her name is Feeling Graceful. Now, don't forget to check out our workout analysis every racing day. SantaAnita.com forward slash analysis, our workout report, race by race with all the key workouts. It's all there and it's all free. That's our Santa Anita workout report, SantaAnita.com forward slash analysis. Last of the 12.